In HealthWorks, the little girl from Western Michigan who, as a baby, was attacked by a raccoon, takes another huge step in her recovery journey. We were there as Charlotte went in for her final facial surgery. There are two things that will always get 10-year-old Charlotte Ponce to smile, a stuffed animal and her family, silly big brother Marshall included. I think she finally realized how, you know, that she's realizes that it's a miracle. This day ends a painful chapter and marks a new beginning. Okay, sweetie, let's go. Charlotte was beautiful when she was born, but soon after, she was attacked, her face disfigured by a pet raccoon. With each pattern, she started to become painfully aware of how different she looked. So her adoptive parents set out to find help, and the Spring Lake family found it in Metro Detroit. In August, Dr. Concrete Shai said a Beaumont Hospital cranial facial and plastic surgeon started the process of rebuilding Charlotte's nose and upper lip. Correct everything, thinking that she's going to grow. You look at her upper lip that we gave her, it's bigger than the, the normal one. I kind of like that. It's easier to remove than add tissue. The healing will take time. There will be bandages and scars for a while. But when you look beyond that, on the inside, Young Charlotte is a little girl filled with joy. It's awesome that's, you know, that's the best Christmas present she could ever get. Charlotte is now out of surgery in recovery. She will be home well in time for Christmas. Next year, surgery will begin to reconstruct her ear. She's been a real trooper. This has not been easy for her and her family, but we thank Charlotte and her family for sharing this story with all of us. That's HealthWorks. I'm Dina Santafonte. What a brave little girl. Brave little girl, and we think about the entire family yeah. in the holiday season, and always. We wish them all well.